Good morning, my beautiful people. Ever want to learn how to start an Amazon business, but you had no idea where to get started? Or maybe you heard from other people that it literally takes a long time to break even from your initial investment and you're afraid of losing money? Well, in this video, we're revealing how people are literally starting Amazon businesses for free with no experience and literally making money on day one. More with that after the intro. Hey guys, how's it going? Mike Facile here. Welcome to this video. Before we actually want to remind you that several spots have opened up for this week's free workshop, where it's the fastest and easiest way to make money online, sign up for it in the link below. We literally have a 62-year-old woman go from zero to 169 profit in 90 days, so sign up for it now. All right, guys, so for you guys to understand the new way to make money with Amazon, which allows complete beginners to make money literally on day one for free with no experience, you gotta find out that figuring out this method literally was an uphill battle for me because I literally started the old way and the hard way that was very, very expensive compared to the new way that is free and you can literally get started today and make money on day one. So let me tell you what you probably shouldn't do if you don't have any experience nor you don't have the money or time to go ahead and get started in things. It's really what I did, right? Like what I did was probably the worst thing that you could probably start, especially if you don't have that much knowledge in business and you don't actually have the right expectations, right? Because I remember when I first got started in my Amazon business, I saw all these people making so much money, man, and I envied them. I was looking at all of their like podcasts and videos and I was like, oh my God, they're so cool. I wanna go ahead and make money with Amazon too. I wanna get ultimate freedom too. I wanna go ahead and travel around the world, uh, pay for my mom and dad's debt, you know, literally having enough money to go ahead and afford the things that I want and actually start feeling freedom in my life. I wanna go ahead and do Amazon. And then guess what ended up happening? I literally went and for example, spent a lot of money in products from China, hoping and praying that maybe I would get rich if I would literally go ahead and buy it at a low cost and then send them over to Amazon and sell it at a high cost. And then, you know, like literally when I did that, I, I, I bought the products, I private labeled them, I made all of it all pretty and whatnot, and I sent them over to Amazon thinking I was gonna get rich. And the moment it went live, nothing happened. Literally nothing happened. And what happened is then I had to spend more money on more services to go ahead and promote these products because it was in very like competitive niches. And before you know it, I was spending several hundreds and more thousands of dollars just with the marketing and sales of this product. And after literally a crazy uphill battle of me moving this like bulk of a debt that I took on to go ahead and sell these physical products, we finally started getting like 700 to $1,000 a day in revenue with my Amazon business. And it literally looked good on paper. It literally looked good when I was like showing my friends and family like, look, I'm able to go ahead and do this. But at the end of the day, the amount of money that we kept that year was literally nothing because every single time we made money, we literally had to go ahead and buy more inventory, right? Like no one understands when they see $30,000 a month revenue. That's not profit. That's not money that they get to keep and spend and blow and spend it on their family and their loved ones. That's literally, you know, just the amount of money collected. But you understand for that $30,000, maybe, I don't know, like Amazon takes 10 to sometimes 15,000 of that. And then the rest literally needs to go and buy more inventory to then sell more products. Does that make sense? So that's like the downfalls of the old way where when you start making money, you literally have to take that money and buy more inventory. And all of the profit that you made is literally in inventory that you can't actually spend because you have to buy more products. Does that make sense? Do you understand the catch 22 when it comes to the old way of the Amazon FBA business? So even though, like I said, we got to 700 to $1,000 a day, we literally made no money because we always had to buy more products, which was, of course, very stressful for someone like me because here I was thinking, oh my God, I'm gonna just send it over to Amazon and I'm gonna get rich quick. And the moment I made the sale, it was great, but then I realized that I didn't actually get to keep the money because I had to buy more products, right? So what would be a new way, right? What would be a new way to actually make money with Amazon for free as a complete beginner where you don't have to suffer through all of those downsides? Well, the more I started thinking, I started thinking things in like what is known as first principles, which what Elon Musk thinks to go ahead and create new ideas out of nothing, right? Like when, they, when he wanted to go ahead and create Tesla, they told him it was impossible because the cost of batteries were so expensive, right? But when he started breaking down, well, what is a battery made out of? Oh, it's made out of iron, uh, nickel, cobalt, whatever those things. And he found the raw prices for those materials. He found out that he could actually get, you know, the raw materials of a battery at a 10th of a cost. 
And then he realized that starting you know, that type of business is the reason why people didn't do it is because they just assumed that it was impossible and hard when they didn't break it down to the fundamental nature of what entails the constraint of that business. And when I started thinking like that in Amazon, I was like, well, why, why do people spend thousands of dollars on Amazon, right? Well, number one, literally because Amazon gets about, as you can see, 3 billion visitors a month, okay? And 3 billion visitors a month where a lot of these people literally have their credit cards attached to their Amazon account. And with one click of a button, it literally goes ahead and allows them to buy something and ships it directly to them with you not having to do customer service, with you not having to go ahead and for example, do the shipping and handling, with you not actually having to talk to anybody, right? And assuming if you could rank for a keyword where you could see this is literally what people are searching for, assuming you could rank for something like grill mats for grilling and you rank on the first page of it, right? Because the, the goal is to rank on the first page, that if someone could literally go ahead and click on this and buy, right? And it literally ships to them without touching you, you could potentially make passive income, right? So that is kind of like the promise when it comes to Amazon. There's so many people on there with their credit cards attached and that buyer's mentality that if you could find a way to rank for a keyword that Amazon essentially tells you here, right, for a low competition keyword, then you can literally go ahead and make money. But like I said, the old way is you spending the money yourself to buy inventory. But what if, what if you leverage somebody else to go ahead and spend that money for you and you just found a lucrative way to rank for certain keywords that have very low competition, that has very little, how, you, how do you say, resistance for someone to actually go ahead and buy. Now this is when I started doing a little bit of research and I started typing in the word free, right? I was like, okay, free is a popular word in a lot of things, like, like in a lot of search engines. Google, YouTube, Pinterest, um, the word free gets people to go ahead and take action a lot faster, a lot sooner, a lot, you know, just, you know, with more urgency, right? And I started literally looking at this, and look at this, a lot of people start typing the word free. So I was like, oh, what if I just type in the word free weight loss? And look at this, free weight loss books. And I literally clicked on that, and I started noticing one thing that there was literally people that rank on the first page of this where you would think that you know this would have thousands of pages or hundreds of pages, but this is literally the second search, uh, the search term right here. Only 69 reviews compared to like the 18,000 for the competitive niche that I was in with the grill mats, right? And you can see, look at this, only 15 pages, only 15 pages. Now you're probably wondering, how the hell is this person making money for free at zero dollars selling on Amazon? Well, here's the thing, okay, look at this, 13 fat blasting ads, right? If you were gonna go ahead and do this, where would you go ahead and make money? Well, understand that you are getting people who are literally in a lucrative niche because people wanna lose weight, so it's a big problem. Number two, if people download this, they already admit that they have a problem, so they're problem aware, right? And because they have their credit card linked to, for example, Amazon, they are buyers, okay? So if you really think about it, what a lot of these people are doing, the 13 fat blasting hacks, they're literally signing up for, for example, kdp.amazon.com where they could essentially create an ebook or a paperback for free with Kindle Direct Publishing reaching millions of readers on Amazon, okay? So that's the first step. Number two, most of them are not writers, so they probably go to Fiverr and just type in nutrition plan and get someone else to go ahead and create a nutrition plan for them as well. Like, check this out, look at this. Like some of these people that create nutrition plans will do it for like five bucks, right? The next step is some of these 13 steps, each one is a recommendation to a product, right? So many of them will literally go sign up for ClickBank for free, where you get access to thousands of products that already have the inventory. They'll do the shipping, the handling, the customer service without any risk to you and without you having to spend any money, a single dollar on inventory at all, and it's completely free. And check this out. You can literally find out that the top products right now where 900 people have made money with this in the past 30 days are literally dietary supplements. Check this out. And they literally pay $150 per conversion. So imagine this, you literally rank on this term. Someone goes ahead and downloads your product and in, the, in like the Kindle book, you literally click on a link that sends them to a product that literally, you know, they'll do the shipping, handling, and customer service and they'll pay you most of it. 150 bucks per commission. Check this out, look at this, Java Burn. That could be like number two. 636 people have made money with this in the past 30 days, $116 per commission. Right, so do you see if you literally go ahead and create like a free ebook and you rank it on Amazon, 
that not only can you make money, but you literally get to keep the money in terms of commissions without actually having to buy more inventory, right? So do you see why I love ClickBank? I mean, as you can see in just one of the businesses that I started back in 2018, that's how we went in the health and wellness space from zero to $256 that following week, to two grand that following week, to $700 the following week, to $6,900 in a single week in commissions, without me having to do shipping and handling, without having me do customer service, without me having to do all of that. And that's what leverage can do when you go ahead and depend on other people to spend money on inventory so you don't have to. Compare that to if you wanted to go ahead and start an Amazon business, you know, and you wanted to sell, for example, supplements, what would you rather do? Get paid 150 bucks upfront where you don't have to spend money on, for example, you know, more inventory, or where you literally sell something for 16 bucks and then you have to buy a lot more in inventory, right? So that's just something to take into account, and this is something what people are doing, literally as shown right in front of your face from people that are literally ranking for certain keywords like free, ranking it, and then recommending it to you know like affiliate marketing products. That's how they're making money. Not from the Kindle, but using it as a traffic source to literally siphon out some of the three billion people into their own products and services and even in their own email list. And this is just one way to make money. For example, with affiliate marketing using Amazon, there's a bunch of other ways. And some ways are even a lot faster than this, right? Like the new way right now that Dina did to literally go from zero to $30,000 a month as a stay at home mom at 47 years old, or for example, Greg at age 50 years old, how we went from zero to 30 grand a month in five to eight weeks. We're revealing the step-by-step -step blueprint this week in this week's free workshop. So all you gotta do is sign up for it this week right now below as well. Check out this video on this podcast right now. Hold yourself. Love you guys. See you guys later. Woo!